Convicted killer Aaron Hernandez's two co-defendants will be tried separately. Ernest Wallace and Carlos Ortiz appeared in a full River courtroom today. Both are facing murder charges in the death of Odin Lloyd in 2013. Highway to Sue's reporter Susan Campbell was in court today and has the details that are new at 10. Prosecutors told the judge they're going to try Ernest Wallace and Carlos Ortiz separately. Ernest Wallace's trial will come first. Carlos Ortiz and Ernest Wallace appearing in the same courtroom as their cases move closer to trial. Prosecutors say the men shot Odin Lloyd to death in this North Attleboro Industrial Park in June of 2013. Former Patriot star Aaron Hernandez has already been convicted of the murder and sentenced to life in prison. Now we know the judge is expecting Wallace's trial to start in March and Ortiz's trial to begin sometime in June. We gave a notice of rights. Today, the judge also heard a motion to suppress evidence gathered during police interviews with Ortiz. 2013. John Moran from the Massachusetts State Police says he spoke with Ortiz for hours, days after Lloyd's death. He was relaxed and um, he was clear. Uh, we were able to engage in conversation. Moran says Ortiz was read his Miranda rights, then questioned about the murder. During the recorded interview, Ortiz told police Hernandez threatened him. At first, he denied everything, but eventually, he said that uh, uh, he, he had uh, fell asleep during the uh, the ride to um, uh, uh, Ronald C. Maya through the industrial park. But Ortiz's attorney says the interview was improper. You told him constantly, they're going to blame you. Yes. You're the guy they're going to blame. I did say that. You're the guy that's going down for this. I don't know if I said that. That was your, that was your intention. The hearing on the motion to suppress will continue on Tuesday afternoon. Oden oh, Lloyd's family was in the courtroom. They declined to comment after the hearing. In the newsroom, Susan Campbell, Eyewitness News.